What we try to do is design it from the start in a way that it can come back in the same product. When you throw something away, where is away? There is no away. We live in a world with finite materials. Products are made cheaper and cheaper, disposable and more disposable on a daily basis. You take raw materials, you process the raw material, you make a product, then the consumer uses it for a certain amount of time, and then it's thrown in the bin. Plastic bottles and ketchup sachets, you use them for probably a few minutes. And then the packaging is on the environment for several years. Waste. Sheer, needless, unforgivable waste. What we are offering is a new point of view of how to think about packaging and, and how to challenge the standards that currently plastic packaging is giving us. We are trying to match the shelf life of the product that is inside of the packaging with the shelf life of the packaging itself. Ojo, it's a membrane made of seaweed that is biodegradable and as well edible. You just consume it and then the packaging won't be there for more than a few weeks. Carpet only get 3% recycling rate these days in Europe, a little over 10% in some states in the US, but that's really where we are today and it's not enough. What we try to do is design it from the start in a way that it can come back in the same product. Once the consumer has finished using them, they can be taken apart and then put in the respective loops and processed and close the loop again and again. We are looking at mattresses, carpets, furniture that is today made out of particle board, MDF or similar materials. Typically glues are made to, to make two different layers bond for as long as possible, the strongest possible. And after use you can never separate the two. It's a very sad story and it all ends up in landfill where it's burned. It took a bit of material science and smart thinking of my colleagues really to design a glue that could decouple after use very easily with a frequency signal. The mattress has a lot of material in it, so the residual value is pretty big if it's designed well. And of course for the manufacturers, it makes sense to know when I change my mattress or my carpet because then I'm in the market for a new product. And if you have mattresses for a hotel chain, and why not have a maintenance contract for those hotels? to make sure that you have a constant quality. With our adhesive, you can change different layers at different moments in time, because it's not always glued together for eternity. So we are working now on toiletries, putting together several trials with hotels, where we will be able to deliver small volumes of shampoos and gels. There's a lot of innovations out there that has not yet taken mainstream. And what is really important is to make sure that those innovations that can save us are taken and scaled up. This is, to me, the only way for us to fight climate change and to fight uh, pollution, to fight waste. And these innovations keep away the materials that would have otherwise found their way into natural ecosystems, reducing threats to biodiversity. <laughs>